Windows shouldn't fail after just a few years, but for one condominium building in the Chicago suburbs, a few small leaks were signs of widespread issues. The issues started to become more frequent and up, up to and including, uh, we had a few windows that actually fell out of the, of the building and we hired building technology consultants, the engineer, to come in and find out why these windows were falling out. Upon conclusion of that investigation, um, we were able to provide the facts uh, regarding what we found at the association. These vinyl clad wood windows had deteriorated along the sill, and so there was rot, rotted wood at those locations. Ultimately, what we found is that there were many deficiencies with the existing windows, which would either allow water penetration or would pose fall hazards to building occupants and those below. One clearly was the installation of the windows. There were several issues with hairline cracks, tears in the vinyl, and screws which were becoming loose on the crank hardware, which uh, began this investigation in the first place. The condo board decided to replace the windows in the 192 openings in the building and the engineers turned to Marvin Windows to help find a solution using their ultimate casement. Marvin's extensive experience with large-scale replacement projects in condominiums, dorms, and apartment buildings made them a natural partner for this type of project. As consultants, we typically um, deal with commercial buildings. For this building, we want a performance grade of C-PG50. The original installation did not have a sill pan assembly. We prefer to use a sill pan assembly. In this particular case, what we wanted to avoid was anchoring the new windows through the sill pans. And so we worked with Marvin Windows windows in their architectural department. We used masonry brackets that were bent and made a metal-to-metal -metal connection between the back dam of the pan flashing assembly and those masonry brackets. So it kind of serves as two purposes. One, to provide the drainage system below the windows, and two, as a structural support for the windows. One thing that we had um, included in the specifications was ensuring that all windows were mold in the factory, which was an issue that we found during the original construction that uh, many of the original windows were, were mold in the field, leaving it up to the personnel there. Here we were able to determine that the sizes were within range that could be shipped. The site is one unit. By choosing a manufacturer up front, it gave us the opportunity to design the project more efficiently, to actually have our details match the architectural details of the manufacturer. Performance has to be in requirements with what would be expected of a building of this type and size. 